I went in and I went up to neurosurgery and they did all the tests on me there. And that's the first time that I came to know Virginia Mason because they told me I had Parkinson's. My writing had turned from this beautiful script to a little line. <laughs> And then uh, my right side of me, I was dragon. And then I, uh, it was harder to communicate. I didn't understand what it really was, but I knew it was tremendous. And I remember thinking, uh, I was having such a struggle trying to walk at that time. It was kind of like, I didn't understand the full value of what Parkinson's was, but it was devastating. I was dead set against doing any, you know, surgery to the head thing. I was like, no, that's not me. But boy, when it came to the time where it was a choice of quality of life and there was nothing left, and I said, this is either this or that. And at that point, I was totally dystonied, bent over. I couldn't talk. I was in horrible pain with the dystonia, just horrible. Poor caregivers, they had to lift my leg. Everything had to be, I had to be moved. I'm, they're so happy to see me on the other side now. The surgery that I went for was the deep brain stimulation. And my first surgery was done on June 10th. And they go in through your head, and through, there's like seven D staples in there when they got through. You're awake. And then the second part on June 24th, they brought the wires down my neck. And then there's implants, two of them right here. And then the doctors, when I come in once a month, they pull their computers out of their pocket and they program me. And so I'm really a bionic woman. Before I couldn't talk very far, I would just have to stop. I had no, none of, none of this. Now I'm full of life and I want to keep going. Dr. Froki and Maria, what a team. They have this, and the, shell, the wonderful team, they just get so positive scheduled me in and it just kept going so i mean it's been very easy with this with them as my doctors because they've gone right in i feel perfectly safe and then there's dr roberts who's the parkinson's doctor he came in right shortly after that and he's been my doctor ever since then. And I've gone to all the Parkinson seminars until I couldn't go anymore. I thank him. I thank him for my life. Well, and John Roberts has gone through a lot with me because he's known all the things that I went through during this time. I always say it's only Virginia Mason. You're the best. You're cared for in every way. I have new life. I have a second new beginning. Anyway, it's my new lease on life.